A very good morning. Today, my presentation will be based on the application of Archimedes' principle. So before we discuss about the application of Archimedes' principle based on a submarine, we must first know what is a submarine and what are the characteristics of a submarine. So, what is a submarine? So the basic definition of a submarine is that a submarine is a watercraft capable of independent operation underwater. So as shown in the diagram above, we can see that a submarine consists of a cylindrical body with hemispherical or conical ends. Another one characteristic of submarine is that it has located amidships. So now, what is amidships is the one which is located in the middle of the ship, either longitudinally or laterally. It functions to house communication and sensing devices as well as periscopes. A submarine also consists of other characteristics such as ballast tanks and periscopes. So now let's take a closer look of what is a periscope and what is a ballast tank. So here we have an example of how a periscope looks like. So when submerged at a shallow depth, the periscope allows the submarine to search visually for targets. For your information, we can see that the ship and the periscope are further away from each other, but the periscope is able to detect the target from a far distance. So this clearly explains the function of a periscope. So the next characteristic is the ballast tank. So a ballast tank is known to play a big role in the application of Archimedes principle based on the submarine. So why is the ballast tank important and what is the function of ballast tank is? A ballast tank is a compartment within a floating structure, which in this case is a submarine. So the function of a ballast tank is that it holds water to provide the stability for a vessel. So why is water used to provide a stability for a vessel is because using water in a tank provides an easier weight adjustment than the iron ballast in the older vessels. Since we have finished discussing about the structure and the definition of a submarine, we can move on to the Archimedes principle so that we can discuss about the application. What is Archimedes principle? Archimedes principle is where the force exerted on an object immersed in a liquid, whether fully or partially submerged, is equal to the weight of the fluid that the object replaces. So to get a more clear view of this concept of Archimedes principle, and before explaining how it applies to a submarine, we will take a more simpler example to understand this concept. And this concept uses the dynamometer. As we can see, we have a heavy object which is weighed 1 kg, which is hung onto the dynamometer. And the weight of the object displayed on the dynamometer is 10 N. Next, the solid is then partially submerged into the water. And as we can see, the weight of the object displayed on the dynamometer has reduced by 3N. So for those who are wondering why the weight of the object displayed on the dynamometer has reduced, this is due to the repulsion of water on the object. So as we can see in the diagram, the arrows pointing upwards represents the force F, which is determined by the expression F equal to dV. Since we finally understood the concept of Archimedes principle, let's apply the same concept towards the construction of submarine, because the same goes for submarine. So to control its buoyancy, the submarine uses a balance tank that contains water. When diving, the lid is opened, allowing the air to escape and the water is pumped into the ballast tank. Therefore, this causes the weight of the submarine to increase. This means the weight of the submarine is more than its buoyant force. 
there in net downward force, causing the submarine to sink. Now, on the other hand, to float, water is pushed out from the balance tank, which causes the weight of the submarine to decrease. This also means that the weight of the submarine is smaller than the upthrust. There, in net upwards force, therefore the submarine floats. So that is all for the application of Archimedes principle based on the submarine. Thank you.